Welcome to our exploration of Unicode and Python requests. Today, we're tackling a fascinating question that dives deep into the intricacies of string handling in Python. Our viewer asks, what happens when we try to access a URL with special characters using Python requests? Let's unravel this mystery together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy, just like me, and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. Let's begin by understanding the difference between Unicode and byte strings in Python 2. The Unicode string U is kick 3 day consists of two code points, E and in contrast, the byte string A represents the UTF-8 encoding of the character A. Now when we access the URL in a browser, it works perfectly. Let's define this URL in an IPython session as a Unicode string and print it. Next, we attempt to fetch this URL using Python requests. First, we try passing the Unicode URL directly, but we receive a 404 error. Then we encode it to UTF-8, but still get a 404. Finally, we try URL encoding, but that doesn't work either. Interestingly, when we use the byte string representation with the character A, ah, the request succeeds and returns a 200 status. This highlights a key difference in how requests handles these strings. Finally, we explore why Scrappy handles the Unicode URL without issues, while requests does not. The culprit may lie in how requests prepares the URL, particularly with its handling of byte strings in Unicode. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. The issue arises because the URL uses Latin 1 encoding for the A character, but Python 2's requests library encodes it in UTF-8, leading to a 404 error. Encoding the Unicode URL in Latin 1 before calling request.get doesn't work either, as it tries to decode it to Unicode first, causing an invalid UTF-8 sequence error. In contrast, Python 3 handles this seamlessly, requiring less manipulation of text encoding. A simple request.get call returns a successful response. For Python 2.7, a workaround is tricky. However, using URL lib with a manually encoded Latin 1 URL works, making it a viable option if you must use Python 2. Ultimately, if you're working on a script, switching to Python 3.6 is recommended for easier data handling. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. Here's an interesting observation with Python requests in Unicode. When making a request to a specific URL, the first attempt returns a 404 error, but the second attempt returns a 200 success. This happens because the first request lacks cookies, leading to a failure while the second request includes cookies set by the server. The 
key takeaway is that the first request fails due to missing cookies, which causes a redirect that doesn't work properly. The second request, however, successfully sidesteps the redirect because it has the necessary cookies. Interestingly, even a request without cookies can return a 200 status if the URL is encoded differently. This indicates a potential bug on the server side, where the redirect location header is not consistently encoded. In summary, the issue seems to stem from the server's handling of URL encoding and redirects. Properly encoding the location header would prevent these errors. And that's it. I hope that that's helped find the solution that you're looking for. And if it did, please, I'd appreciate it if you hit the subscribe button. Every time you hit it, it really helps. Now, I'll see you next time, next time you need some technical help. And until then, have a good one.